Hello. Welcome back to Rad System Studio View Page Properties. My name is Tuzik. In today's episode of View Page Properties, we will learn default query configuration. Click on any table of your choice, select Table View Page, locate and default query configuration from the page properties. Before we proceed, let's publish and preview our project. Our project has three tables, but I'm going to join the sales table on the customer table list page. This will in turn take effect on the view page. To set up view page default query confirmation, we have to do it from the list page. This will also take effect on the view page in return. From the list page, locate default query configuration on the page properties. Click on the joint tables field. Click on the options button. A dialog box pops up. Here we have all the available tables from our database, we can double click on any of the table to select, also we can use these action button to add or remove selected tables. On this side we have list of selected tables we want to join. From join condition section, we can select fields keys to match with. Click on the left field, and select a primary field key you want to match. Click on the right field, and select a foreign field key. I'm going to use sales customer ID. Click on the, the join type field to select the type of join you want. I will use inner join. Click OK. Navigate back to view page. Observe, view page fields are now populated with join table fields too. Publish project and then preview in the browser to see changes. Observe the join table fields are now on the customers list page. and we also have it on the, the view page. To disable the join table from the list page, go back to Rad System Studio, select the list page, uncheck joined fields output. Publish project and then preview in the browser to see changes. As we can see, joined field are not visible on the list page, but we still have those fields visible on the view page. Now we have learned how to set up view page default query configuration. Please subscribe to our channel and enable notification bell icon to get notified when we post a new video tutorial like this. Thank you.